Good morning, adventurers. Good well, morning. Almost missed the swing. From New York. <laughs> Just kidding. We are actually in the beautiful state of Montana. This mm -hmm. is our first time here. So last time you guys saw us, we were in Williamsburg in Brooklyn, mm -hmm. doing a little food tour there, but we ended up hopping a flight over to Seattle, then over to Montana. New state for us. We have never been here before. As you can tell though, it is beautiful. It's beautiful I really guys. feel like it's a mountain Texas. There are so many cowboys here, you guys. We are actually at Sony Camera Camp. So they invited a bunch of creators to come and try out a bunch of new gear. I'm super excited because there's been a bunch of new gear that they've come out with that I've been wanting to try, like the mm -hmm. microphone I'm using right now. It's a brand new microphone that is unreleased. We are staying at this beautiful ranch called Flathead Ranch. It's this property that's been around for a very, very long time. There are a bunch of different cabins placed about. There are horses everywhere. The place is absolutely beautiful. Yeah, so I think it started as a boys camp back in the 30s. And then in the 40s, a family took it over and it has been in the same family ever since. So this is the third generation running it. We're actually on a little island right now that's part of the property, but it's really cool because you just walk along the dock and then you're on this tiny little secluded mm -hmm. island away from everyone. Yeah, you can it's have really bonfires neat. out here. They were having a band going last night. It was mm -hmm. very cool. We've got all sorts of fun stuff we're gonna be doing today. We're gonna go to a steak fry. We're gonna go to a barn dance. <laughs> I don't know if they wanna see us dancing. No, though. I don't know if we'll be dancing. <laughs> we'll but see how that goes. I feel like we're not cowboyed up enough for that. So there's actually a trailer that pulled up in the front of the ranch where I think we're gonna get to pick out a cowboy hat and then they're gonna size it up for us and stuff. Yes, so it'll finally be... fit this huge forehead of mine. <laughs> Let's do it, y'all. I need to decide between the hard one or the soft one. <laughs> also, so many colors. Oh, so many colors. Yeah, you look like a yes. southern oil maiden. <laughs> I feel like I need like a badass pantsuit to go with this hat. <laughs> we have officially picked out our new hats and now I guess we go outside to get them custom fit. This is pretty wild you guys. Yeah, this is a lot of fun. Let's <laughs> see what we got. Next step. Yeah, he's got the look, yeah, doesn't he? Oh, yeah. I don't grow them like this around these parts no more. <laughs> Found the horses, you guys. Hey, buddy. Well, you're just a little sweetie, huh? Hi, dear. <laughs> <gasps> nice to meet oh you, too. Good. Oh, God. <laughs> it's a cowboy hat. Horses are intimidating, honestly. They're so massive. Holy cow, you guys. That was a lot of fun. And we learned so much about cowboy hats and shaping them and the different styles and all kinds of stuff. Larry was the guy we were hanging out with and he has that little mobile uh, hat working shop. Yeah, he's been doing it for almost 45 years of shaping hats. Yeah. Man, he is just a wizard with a hill talk to you and tell you stories while he's like shaping it into this beautiful creation. Yeah, he was and... a super cool guy. Man, yeah. I'd spend the whole day with him. Yeah, but it's just in time because it just started raining, but we're not getting wet because we got our super cool cowboy hats yeah, we do. on. Bye. Love you. <laughs> we have left the ranch y'all we're getting out into nature today <laughs> for sure montana has been beautiful so far you guys we're definitely going to be spending quite a bit more time here we've always wanted to visit because we've seen it in so many other people's videos and it's yeah. living up to it for sure we're cowboys and cowgirls now, yeah, i think yeah, how, we do are. We, how do we look you guys <laughs> but we uh found a trail that's just outside or just in big fork the yeah, town of it's big in fork the city and it starts just like off of a road you just go and it's amazing yeah. it's so beautiful we've got riley up there with us who's taking us around tell us about the area there's a rushing rapids down there i think we're yeah. going to make our way down to that river but mm -hmm. it looks absolutely stunning from up here you guys we walked down near the water it was such an easy little walk down here i don't know i always am blown away when it's such an easy walk for such a big reward yeah it's beautiful because sometimes we've hiked like our asses off yeah to get to something like this but this is yeah. just off of a really nice <laughs> trail great. but the water i mean the color is amazing yeah it's like this green blue yeah i really wasn't expecting that it looks it's amazing it's really beautiful and they say in the summertime i think this fills up and it turns into is it number four rapids i don't know I the think it was four, four. Out of something. yeah I which maybe. i think is pretty substantial and they have um like kayak races down here which is totally wild 
Well, that was just beautiful, you guys. We spent entirely too much time there. We've got all this gear that we got from Sony in my bag that I've been <laughs> messing with and snapping photos with ah, and all kinds of stuff. Ah. I'm really not used to this cowboy hat. I keep running into everything. <laughs> We're going to head back to the ranch and then... Yes, we are going to an elk preserve. Oh, yeah. And then we have our steak dinner on top of a mountain, supposedly. Yeah. Stay tuned for that because I think that's going to be amazing. We've been looking forward to it for days. Mm -hmm. Our next adventure for the day is to go see some elk in an elk preserve and check out what we're riding in, you guys. Look at this. I'm wondering if it's like a... Oh, this yeah. reminds me when we were uh watch your head this is uh metal right here oh yeah and, uh, oh jeez watch your cowboy like hat my, like my... it reminds me when we were um in deest and we did that tour around the airfield yeah. it's a bit of a bumpy ride <laughs> this one luckily has some cushioning the last time yeah, did not the dream, the dream oh crew yeah we're all in here okay i'm coming we're riding in style yeah we are riding in style Oh, you guys have your cowboy hats and everything. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. We're, We're committed to Montana at this point. Oh, yeah. <laughs> We're doing a barn dance yeah. tonight, so everyone better be wearing their cowboy hats. Oh, yeah. We're going cowboy. full cowboy. I, even got it yet. I don't know. Maybe. Oh, yeah. Everyone's trying them out. Yeah. yeah. Nice. There's actually four. What? Oh, wow. Oh, check him out. We've been driving around for a while and we just found our first elk and they are huge. These are all yearlings. They're probably one to three years old. Typically they have about a six foot span on their antlers. They shed their antlers every year and regrow new ones. Their antlers can grow up to an inch a day in the sunlight. Y'all got a perfect time oh too. This is like calm up here. So this preserve obviously has a bunch of elk on it, but as you can see, it also has an amazing viewpoint. So we drove up to the top and you can see like the whole lake, you can see the mountains, and it is a pristine day for it yeah. too. It's absolutely gorgeous out here. Yeah. You guys, it's a beautiful day. Mm -hmm. That is not a bad view. It is beautiful and it's not very windy. It's a little breezy. Oh yeah, <laughs> too short better? for this. <laughs> so we're staying at the lodge, but if you stayed in town, you could obviously come, I think, and recreate all of mm -hmm. these things. And the town seems so cute and quaint. And in the winter time, I imagine it just gets cuter and quainter. -er. <laughs> quainter. -er. <laughs> <laughs> and we're gonna take an epic photo from back there. Okay. We're gonna have all of us hanging off the vehicle, pointing our cameras, looking epic. Right yeah. on. Camera creators. Nadine is yeah. orchestrating the perfect group photo yes. that we are about to take. This is a photo you're not gonna see anywhere else. No, we're right here. <laughs> right here. We're hashtag break right. the internet. <laughs> all right, group photo time. I wish I had a little. Uh... Where do I'll I get from this, but yeah. I'll just get, oh, you know, let me yeah, 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 yeah. Alright, super excited. Hey. Woo! Let's see some elk. Well, that was amazing, exploring the elk preserve. We got closer to them than we thought we were going to get. Yeah, it was they, awesome. You could essentially reach out and pet them, I feel. I just spilled my beer. <laughs> Oops. I swear this is only the second one. The second beer, yeah. We are about to head to our dinner spot. What we were told was that we we're going to cram into a bunch of fire trucks that they have yeah, on the you ranch. Yeah, can't hear the siren. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know why they have fire trucks on the ranch, but we're all going to pile into them. We're going to drive to a special spot and then we're going to have like a steak fry? Yeah, a campfire steak dinner or something like yeah, that. Yeah, which is and right up our alley, you guys. Barn dance. So, gosh, these cowboy hats are getting so much use this yeah. week. Or... <laughs> Should I say it again? <laughs> Oh my God. <laughs> fire truck, come on. It's a fire truck. This is how we should travel everywhere like forever. fire truck rooftop party. This, this is, is insane, it's wild. Like what up boys? What up? Hey, hey. Oh, Mike's here too. Someone called this a Montana Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> How was that? That was amazing. We have been on so many unique old vehicles today. I did not expect that. <laughs> when they started shooting the, what is it, the water cannon? Something like, like that. that. Yeah. We for sure got on the best fire truck. This California, here I come, but gonna let the wagon roll. Hey now, life and independence. Was crazy, wild, and free. Yeah, it was 18. 
the hustle and the bustle and finally made supply. They're having a blast out here, y'all. They have this clearing that everyone's hanging out in where they're cooking up a bunch of steaks that look it's, amazing. I wish you could smell yeah. the fire, the steaks going, everything. It's phenomenal. Yeah, and I popped the drone up and there were incredible views from all around. It's just a really cool spot. Yeah. They also have beer. More beer. <laughs> yeah. There you go. Perfect. Thank you. Check out these steaks that they grilled up for us. They're huge, yeah. <laughs> like as big as you my head. You have to tell them the temperature. Yeah, they yeah. tested them all, so this should be medium. It's been on the fire for a bit though, and it was it had some um, sauce on it, like a yeah. chimichurri it sauce or something. Pretty good. These cowboys know how to cook a steak. <laughs> Let's just put it that way. If they don't it know how to great. cook a steak, are they cowboys? No, no. probably not. You would fail. I gotta talk so. about the beans for a second. They are some of the best beans I've ever had. Mm -hmm. They really are amazing. Yeah. There's some kind of herb, like sage or rosemary or something like that, that's in the beans. And they're not overcooked. Every bean kind of pops in your mouth. It's so good. And they're a little bit sweet. I didn't think the beans would be the highlight, but they really are. So up next is the barn dancing portion of this evening. And we need a little liquid courage for that. <laughs> beautiful day we've made a little drive out to Glacier National Park yeah it was a bit of a trek a couple hours to get out here from the lodge but definitely worth it there are so many stops that you can make along the way it reminds me kind of of Canada where you kind of like see the mountains off in the distance and then they get closer and closer and then you're all of a sudden in the middle yeah. of them and then there are views like this yeah I mean look at this this view that we've got behind us right now this is incredible it's absolutely fantastic and the weather even though it is windy it is so nice out here and sunny it's pretty much the perfect day for viewing the cutest little island in the middle of the prettiest lake. <laughs> By the way, how'd you guys like that uh, hoedown that we had <laughs> last night? We danced and danced our little hearts yeah, out. Yeah, my battery life. ended up dying at the oh, end, yeah, but we, we were, were both gonna... on the dance floor, not just Allison. No. But she killed it, didn't she? It was amazing. Yeah. <laughs> Eric did as well. You didn't get to see that. Sorry, no, guys. she did so good. I actually didn't realize she was such a good line dancer. Line dancing? I didn't realize. It might be my jam. Yeah. I really enjoyed it. Although, it is freaking hard it jumping really around for like hours. But once hours. you get it, it's so much fun. Yeah. We are deep inside Glacier National Park. And let me tell you guys, it is absolutely stunning. Incredible views all around, fog rolling through the mountains. It's fantastic. And for those of you who don't know where this is, it's in the Montana Rocky Mountains. So up in the very tippy top of Montana. It was actually um, established in 1910. So she's an old lady park. Yeah, and around this park, you're gonna see bears, mountain lions, sheep, all kinds of wildlife. We've been warned about the bears from the locals at least 10 times <laughs> since we got to Montana. So watch out for the bears. We haven't seen yes, any yet, but we maybe we will. Any. It's such a beautiful place. I, I, got, like... I got a stopper. I think there's a ranger telling us that we're in a spot we're not supposed to be in. <laughs> oh, we can't be here? Okay, redo. Apparently <laughs> these tiny little chains, you don't want to step past those at all because <laughs> he was not happy about it. What we were saying was, hope you guys enjoyed coming along with us to camera camp and scoping out the ranch a bit. We had a blast at the ranch. It was so much fun meeting all the people who run it. Oh the, yeah, the hoedown barn dance that we oh did. Oh my gosh, it was all yeah, great. it's all been so great. They have so much land there and so many different activities to do there. If it were a little warmer, we could have gone swimming in the lake, which would have been amazing. Yeah. Next up, we are going to be off to Seattle. We're going to be visiting our friend Matt, mm -hmm. which you guys have probably seen in the videos. Yep, recently. he's a old school traveler with us and our old school friend. Goodbye, adventures. We'll see you on the road. <laughs>